Hello, hello, Scorpio, and welcome into Speak Life. My name is Mia. Today is September 15th, and we're going to see what comes through for you from now until the end of the month. Please, Universal Energies, I need two more, two more cards. Okay. I do not do reversals in case you saw me turn that card over. And let me see what we have here. Scorpio, you open up the reading with the three of cups. I cannot help but feel that some of you are celebrating a reunion. Some of you are celebrating something in your life. Okay, some of you are feeling as though you are happy. However, this is also my more than two people card. So we'll keep that in mind because we have here the Ace of Swords. It looks like for some of you in the recent past, you gained some clarity on something. Something came something came in for you that you realize, OMG, this is the way it is. Some of you actually took action against that. However, I am a little concerned because you're finishing up your reading with the Four of Pentacles, holding back, holding on. We're going to see. What, what are you holding on to? What are you not letting go? Listen, for some of you, okay, I'm just going to keep to one story right now. Um, why is the three of cups here? Please, universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors. Why is the three of cups here for Scorpio, sun, moon, rising, and Venus? It is cold. Winter is coming. I am wearing my gloves. <laughs> Okay, you have here the two of pentacles. Listen, for some of you, there was a decision that needed to be made between two people. I'm going to be honest, all right? I'm not going to sugarcoat this. This is not the channel. You had to become independent, okay? For some of you, I felt like you were probably very happy with someone and someone had to make a decision. For some reason, you had to become independent. This is also coming up, the Knight of Swords. I feel that for some of you, you came in very quickly and spilled some truth on someone. If you haven't done it, some of you are planning to spill some truth on something. Somebody is planning to tell you some truth. Take it as it fits. You recently got some clarity on something. Why is the ace here? Ten of Cups. Listen, you gained some clarity that where you were, I feel that for some of you, where you were, this person was, you, you were looking for your Ten of Cups. You were looking for your Ten of Cups before some, one of these bowls, look at this, one of these bowls kicked you in the head or, okay, or, or fell on your head and it's like, listen, don't ignore the truth. You have already gained some clarity, okay? You thought for some of you, I feel that for some of you, I feel that you thought this person could give you your ton of cops, but you gained some clarity and realized that maybe not. They're coming up as a young energy, you know? Um, why, is the ten, why is the four of pentacles here? Please, universal energy. Did I just see a card here turned over? Please, universal energies. Ace of Wands. Ooh. Some of you are looking for a hot, passionate new beginning. Some of you are looking to start something creative, something brand new. Okay. I also feel that for some of you who were scorned in the past by a situation where you received the clarity that you needed. Okay. I feel that for some of you ladies, and I say ladies because she's a lady, but keep in mind that this could also be a man. I feel that this woman or man made a decision. Okay. A decision was reached. A decision was made. Listen, I see you looking up proudly, Scorpio. Okay. Looking up Sprout. <laughs> Sproutly. <laughs> I'm sorry. Proudly. Looking up proudly. Okay. Making a decision. Knowing the, 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 knowing the ground that you step on. Look at how funky she looks. She's beautiful. I think she's cute. All right. So why is it here? Listen, you made a decision. Some of you Scorpios were scorned by somebody immature, okay? And you learned some clarity on this person. 
Queen of Swords. And now you're like, you know what? My heart is so cold. I cannot feel you. The Hierophant. Listen, some of you ladies or men, you could be married to this person. Okay. You or this person may be going through some kind of spiritual awakening. Perhaps this was a situation that actually, listen, after one of these bowls jumped on your head, okay, you gained some clarity. And with that clarity, listen, came some fucking light. Isn't it, it like clarity and light, okay? But like I said, for some of you, this could be married. Some of you, like I said, you're holding back on something. We're going back to the four of pentacles. Why is the four of pentacles here? Why is the Four of Pentacles here? Four of Pentacles. Nine of Wands. Hi, Scorpio. <clears throat> Scorpio, you got the Nine of Wands. This is strength. This is endurance. This is, for some of you, this is gaining the strength to put up with the journey that is ahead of you. Okay, for some of you, you're going to need the strength. In this card, there is not a lion in this card, but you're going to need that strength to move forward, okay? Um, let me see something about this truth. Um, Ace of Swords. Why is the Ace of Swords here? Please, Universal Energies, Spirit Guides, Ancestors. Eight of Swords. I mean, Ace. Ace of Swords. This is way too many, but I will take the one that fell directly on it. Hangman. Oy. Listen, get yourself out of sacrificing yourself. Some of you are still sacrificing yourself. Some of you are willing to still sacrifice yourself over who? Who? Listen, you're gaining your independence. You're not going to need anybody, okay? Somebody here couldn't make a decision. Somebody here was juggling. You could be juggling. They were probably juggling, but you are gaining your independence. Why are you upside down? Listen, you need to stop that. Scorpio, for those of you that are still upside down, listen, it is time to get out of this, okay? There is someone coming for you. This man is going to pick you up, lift you up, sit you down on his white horse and you guys are going to drift off happily ever after <laughs> and that is what i feel you know i'm sorry that is what i feel why is the ten of cups here listen this person might potentially be able to give you your ten of cups king of swords okay some of you thought that this person from your past was able to give you these ten cups but you know what they were cold they were this and this is the king of swords not a happy person, you know, not a loving, warm hearted person. Listen, they think with their head in more ways than one, maybe. I don't know. But let me tell you something. For some of you, I'm going to be honest with you. For some of you, I want you to see this. This is two people potentially angry at each other. No one looking the same way. Okay, looking at each other, but look at, but look, I feel that they're missing each other, missing each other, like, like eyeball to eyeball. They're just not aligned. That is what I feel. That is what I pick up. Um, let me see if I, okay, one more. Why is the hangman here? Why is the hangman here for Scorpio? I can't take three. Why is the hangman here? <sighs> King of Wands, Ace of Pentacles. Listen, go find yourself a business, okay? This is the beginning of a, of a new business. This is the beginning of a money situation, okay? Put your energy into that instead of putting yourself upside down. Listen, for some of you, somebody's going to come and, and rescue you, okay? Okay? The king of wands, somebody younger, somebody sexier, somebody loving. I can't help but feel that these two men are rolled up into one, okay? Thank you so much for being here. And listen, I'm just going to tell you before I go. Some of you ladies got mega choices, okay? There's three men in this reading, okay? Three men. This could also be three women, Thank you so much for being here and enjoy your day, Scorpio.